This isn't the, uh, the, the last thing, so this will take a little bit of time, this bit right here. The other thing that slides out, the actual stock piece slides out. Mine just, uh, I lost it because I uh, put a bit, of, bit too much pressure on this part right here which uh, released the pressure on this and it just fell in the fucking grass and I need like a metal detector to actually get it out so that's, that's my fault, I'm, I'm an idiot, alright I don't, I don't know things about that alright so bear with me This is from sanding it right here. Makes it a bit rough, and you just unscrew these two uh, screws right here, and uh, pull out the barrel. That's it. Easy stuff. I mean, sure, the air is simpler, right? It's very simple. Yes, I own one of these. This right here requires a hex screw. It does. With this, you can pop this pin out right here. Not this, the um, other pin, wherever the hell it went. I don't know where it went. I gotta find it. You know what I'm talking about. This. This one right here, you can just get the cleaning rod and pop it out with that. Uh, with this, you gotta get a hex, and once you do that, um, you know, first you gotta do this. And here's the, uh, watch this. Not much force. Doesn't need to hold on it. Alright. Um, so once you take this thing apart, uh, I don't think I have a hex. Do something like some random metal part I have laying around here. Now, I am not going to do this one, alright? I'm not. I'm just going to try and do this one. Takes a fucking bit. God damn it. It's working. Is it? I think get my point. Also, the own ring system on this thing right here, from what I know on this thing, and I, I have friends that have these problems, like all of them. All of them have this problem except like three, right? Three out of like fucking nine, nine people I met in the field. Uh, this thing, uh, it sucks. And it's not just in like one way. There's a variety of ways that it could suck ass. For me, um, once this thing comes off, this, this bit right here, it's very difficult to put it back on. See how it's like all fucked right here? This is from like using a hammer on it and smacking the shit out of it with like metal magazines. I have an AK metal mag, AK mag around here, and um, it was a pain. It was a huge pain. I'm not, not lying about it. Nope. Huge pain. Good gun. This is a very good gun. Uh, whatever. This is some lunch shit. Let's we put it together. This is dumb. Now it's gonna. I mean, the, M the M4 AR takedown for my AR, what you call it, it's simpler. It is. It, it's a lot easier to do than this, but this right here, you cannot fuck this up. There is no way you can fuck this up. Unless you, like, lose a part. But then you're just dumb. Alright, you're just stupid. For manufacturing mistakes, 
you physically can't take the other one. You can't put it together. It's not manufacturing mistakes, actually. I think it's designed. It's designed as shit. People keep having these fucking bronze steel rings. I don't have a problem with my AK. Sure, part falls down, but you're not supposed to disassemble your gun and grass. Alright, it's a terrible idea. Let's do this. These are two screws taped together with electrical tape. That's what they are. Two screws. Miss a part, do something like this. Who cares? Who fucking cares? Nobody sees it. Like, we're not even going to the field until like three or four months later. Like, in, in the future. From this. So, uh, yeah. Complex. Reliable. Not so complex. Unreliable. And also, that's how you gotta fix this shit. Easy. But my mag physically can, can't come out without breaking it. And I can fix it if it breaks, alright? Easy pieces. I'm shit already got.